was a shocking news for most Ethiopians and authorities here to learn the death of 50 migrants who are said to be Ethiopians and Somalis. The story is even more chilling as the reports indicated that the migrants were deliberately drowned in the sea of Yemen's coast and most are teenagers. The Ethiopian authorities have spoke to said they're trying to get more information about the incident and they will soon reveal their findings to the public. Although Ethiopia's economy continues to grow, the number of illegal migrants from the country has shown little signs of uh, declining over the past five years. Ethiopian authorities say they are momentarily implementing pro-youth uh, projects aimed at creating ample jobs for the young people of the country, which in return could contribute in minimizing migration and risking lives in the process. But experts also say the issue of illegal migration from Ethiopia and the quest of finding a greener pasture elsewhere has to do with the problem of perception and attitude as well. Despite the challenge of finding jobs here in the country, even those who have got it still believe the best is found abroad. So that is why experts suggest the country needs uh, to work on educating the youth as they also provide them with better jobs uh, domestically. For now, no one knows when will the next uh, shocking story of the death of migrants in the seas comes out. And when exactly will this be stopped? Grumtala CGTN, Addis Ababa, Ethiopia.